Hello everybody, it's Nola again. How you doing? It's Friday. Yes, I'm that kind of person that this is what I'm doing on a Friday night. Never mind. Having a nice gentle glass of wine. And I received a package. And as one of my friends mentioned some time ago that she likes unboxing videos, I thought I might do an unboxing. Now I have opened this up with the scissors, but I have not actually opened to see what's inside the package. Of course, I know what's in there because I ordered it. So yeah, I know what's in there. Well, I did when I ordered it. Can I remember 100% what I ordered? Well, you know what it's like. It's come from America. It has taken a while, you know. So we'll see what's in here together. But before that, what I thought I would share with you is that this order is from a place called The Mountain. Now, of course, I am just making videos. I am not sponsored by anybody or anything like that. But I tell you, these are some of my most favorite t-shirts that I own. And often when I wear them, I get amazing compliments about them too. So I thought I would show you what I already have from this company. And I was really surprised when I was ordering these ones that are in the package that some of the ones I own are not available anymore on their website. So um, I thought I would show you what I have. And the first one is actually this one which I wore today which has got koalas on it, one of my most favourite animals. We don't have them here in Western Australia, uh, but they are one of my most favourite animals. The koala, there's a mummy and a baby. And I bought this one when I was at Perth Zoo fairly recently. Uh, late last year, went to the zoo and they had the mountain t-shirts with a whole range of animals. And the things that the mountain offer on their t-shirts is a huge range. They have an enormous range, some of which is animals. So let's go and I'll show you the ones that I already have and then we'll open the package and see what's in there. So the very first mountain t-shirt that I bought was this design. So you can see that it is a peace symbol and when I come closer, you can see that they are all froggies. And some of you, some of you will know that purple is one of my most favorite things and I'm not sure how well the color is coming out. This is most definitely a purple t-shirt and frogs are one of my most favorite things as well. So I just loved this when I first saw it and that was the first design that I purchased from the mountain. It was quite some time ago. This is actually the second one of these t-shirts that I own. Uh, the other one has faded quite a lot over time so when I was ordering more I decided to order another one of these as well. Now the second one that I'm going to show you is probably my second most favorite design. All of them are my favorites. And this is called The Green Man. So this is just this uh, crazy looking guy made out of leaves, kind of peering out of the forest at you. And if you want to have a look, you can look up The Green Man online. You can just Google him and you'll find all kinds of information about The Green Man. And then this one, which I was wearing in a video that I just shot, but I don't think I've posted as yet, is kind of like The Green Man, but it's the female version and I really love this one this is just gorgeous look at that isn't that incredible and that's all kind of leaves and flowers and stuff and there her, she is with her piercing eyes looking out at you then it was Christmas not very long ago and I do like to wear themed clothes at Christmas time and so I have a Christmas t-shirt from the mountain. That's just really cool and a lot of fun. So that one only gets worn a couple of times a year unfortunately. And then this one is for kind of like, not quite cosplay because I don't really cosplay, but for dress ups. 
So this is like when I went to dress as a pirate or something like that. It was called the crow. It's just kind of like a vest with straps and a gun and kind of stuff on it and a great big crow on that side. So I just think that's that's really cool for kind of a dark themed kind of dress ups. And back to the frog theme, I have another frog one that is in the shape of the peace symbol once more but this is a whole range of different frogs the other ones were green tree frogs specifically but this t-shirt has just a whole bunch of different kind of groovy looking frogs included on it and again this is one of my most favorite ones this one gets quite a lot of comments when I wear this so this is a tree with the yin yang symbol in the middle of it and kind of like the light shining through it too really is quite stunning so they're the mountain t-shirts that I already own and now I own some more plus some other things that aren't t-shirts so let's have a look and see what's in the bag hey? I'm going to have some more one I like getting packages. My bank account might not, but I do. So I found that they were selling some face masks. So these are 100% cotton. And here in Perth, Western Australia, I don't know what's happening where you are at the moment. But uh, there's quite a lot of discussion at the moment, particularly amongst the circles that I move, about masks and mask wearing. A lot of people have been using just the surgical masks in regards to trying to avoid or reduce the likelihood of getting infected with um, SARS-2 COVID-19 virus. Um, but... Um, yeah, so I'm, I'm not too sure how this would go. I would probably wear this over the top of a surgical mask. I don't think it's good enough by itself. It does not have a pocket inside to put a filter in there. So this is just a looking good kind of thing rather than a going to stop me from catching any viruses. So I really like that one because it was the yin yang symbol and I do quite like the yin yang symbol you saw it on that t-shirt the last t-shirt that i showed you and then this one i bought for a particular reason this particular face mask because have a look at the design yes it matches the t-shirt how's that they don't actually have the t-shirt online anymore but they had the face mask so I kind of like well I have to get that don't I it's kind of like when you go traveling did you get the t-shirt well I already had the t-shirts and now I've got the mask as well and then this next one oh that is not what I was expecting that to be oh yes it is it's just a bit hard to tell. Maybe with an iron it will be a bit better. But it's a series of love hearts in rainbow colours. So they're the masks that I bought. I have never bought those before from the mountain. When I was buying t-shirts previously, COVID wasn't a thing. So masks were not a thing. And now we're on to the t-shirts. I'm remembering what I ordered now this is really nice this is a, a purple not as deep as the other purple but have a look at that dragons are also something that I really really like let's bring that in closer so you can see the dragon a bit better the wings really nice legs and the tail So the mountain has quite a lot of dragon kind of designs on t-shirts 
but I don't particularly care for a lot of them. That one really took my eye. And then this one, I was, oh dear, it looks like I've bought a child size in error. <laughs> so, Peace Tree Frogs, this is called. You can see the frogs have the red suckers on their feet. And it's a tree with a peace sign in it. Uh, so I'm not really sure what's gone wrong there. I could actually wear it. It's a little shorter than I would usually wear a t-shirt. But I may find someone with a child who might want that one. Two more to go. And I'm kind of getting a bit worried. Maybe these are small sizes as well. This is called Woodland Guardian. So I'm just taking the stickers off. That's what that was. So this is a dragon on a Celtic cross. And I just think that's quite lovely. And then the last one is called moon tree when I was looking at the site this is the first one that really caught my eye really really caught my eye so have a look at this one so there's a tree and there's the moon and there's a face in the tree looking up at the moon So that's all my purchases, that's the package opened and emptied. I hope you'll have a fantastic weekend. See you next time.